I mean, this was like a couple weeks ago, maybe. I, it just warmed my heart because it's rare um, when, you know, we focus on the good stuff in this world. And there are still a lot of great people and human beings in this world. And this story was in Lockhart where Monica, who's an amazing mom, was just worried about her son, Zayden, who was 14 at the time. He just turned 15. But uh, he was getting ready. And I think I can relate to this because it's such a big transitional period in your life when you're going to high school or you're just changing environments in general and I remember going to high school as a kid and I mean I struggled I really really struggled to to just adapt to uh, older people and, and, and new people and my friends a lot of my friends went to a different high school and I it was tough I got bullied and, and it, it, I can only imagine um, what others deal with because mine wasn't even that bad and it still was a problem for me so Monica wrote just this emotional post, a loving post about her son, Zayden, and said, hey, accept my son. Just accept him, give him a chance, because he is one incredible kid, which he is, and he might face some challenges that others don't, but give him a chance. And it warmed my heart, because he's such, he's such an awesome kid, and she's such a great mom. And Lockhart responded, the teachers, the students, the community, they did just that, they welcomed him, and and opened up their arms to him, and I love seeing that. And then I saw that the they, he was helping out with the high school football broadcast in Lockhart. Go Lions, what up? And they were helping him do the broadcast, and I just loved it. I loved it, so I, I was thinking to myself, we got to have him do a high school football report for us, right? So Monica is on the phone, and we're getting ready to do this. Monica, good morning. Good morning. How are y'all? We are awesome. How, is Zayden there too? Yes. Z-Man, what's up? Hey. How are you? Doing good. Well, we're so excited to have you and your first official big sports report uh, this morning, which everybody's been excited for it. And we even have a, we even have an intro for you, if that's cool, okay? Yep. yep. Oh, uh, look, he's a man of few words. That's what I like about you, Zane. <laughs> that's what I like about you. But how's everything going? Are you excited? Uh, I, thank you for doing this, by the way, because I know you don't have to. You're a busy guy. Thank you. All right. Are you ready to go? Yes, sir. Now, this is so important to us that we got an intro, a professional intro just for you and everything. Are we ready? Hit it. High school football in Texas. It doesn't get any bigger or better at all this season. Kiss FM has the scores and highlights you need from the teams you love. Friday Night Lights, all season long. Yes, with the one and only Z-Man. Z-Man, take it away. Hey, it's Z-Man with your Kiss FM Friday Night Lights games of the week. Ooh. Undefeated Westlake heads to Austin High School in a conference matchup kickoff is at 7.30. Tonight at Logan Range High School homecoming game, they're playing the Novaro Panthers. Both teams are undefeated. This should be a great game. Kickoff is 7.30 at Leopard Stadium. My school, my team, the Lockout Lions are on the road tonight to the media. Media Valley Panthers, 7.30 tonight at the at Panthers Stadium. Let's go Lions. Yeah! yeah. <laughs> That was awesome, man. Good job. Thank you. Now, can you do this every week for us? No pressure. <laughs> yeah. Okay, awesome. Good. I love it. Well, go Lions. Z-Man, there he is with your first report. We will do it again next week. And thank you so much. You have a great weekend. Of course, go Lions, though, because we're rooting. Now we feel like we're invested with Lockhart because of you, Z-Man. So if that's cool, we're rooting for the Lions, yep. too. Awesome. Well, thank you so much, Monica. Thank you. Yes, that's right. And have a good weekend, too. Monica, thank you so much. I will. Thank you. You guys have an awesome